Hello everybody, welcome back for another video of Once Haunted Review. On today's video, we're going to talk about the movie I just finally got, got to see and seen. Uh, Fast X, which is Fast, Fast and Furious 10. Part 1, of course. <laughs> so, so there is going to be a little bit few spoilers I might add it. So, just keep that aware of. So, if you guys don't want to see my review, just make sure you check it out. If you guys are okay with it, all my review, say enjoy enjoy all my review review in my mic get spoiled a little bit <laughs> let's just, let's get to the sound story shall we okay um i when i i got a chance to see five to three ten of course and i actually did i actually did enjoy not gonna lie i did it was it was amazing amazing the team great visual effect great directing and the story's on point not gonna lie, the story is definitely at some point for it. That is, I could have done it a long time ago. I mean, like, they could have done it like after Fast and Furious 7. After Fast and Furious 7, then move on to straight to the point, to the final three, final film. Straight straight to the point, get to the point, left a lot. For, let's just forget about the Fate of the Furious, Furious 9. That that is those two films I didn't quite enjoy. Fast ten, Fast Nine, definitely okay. I like it. I like the the story between the brother, the brother and the brothers, of course. Uh so of course John Cena is in the film. He did he did a good job, and I actually did not expect how they ended for him. So I was I was disappointed with that one. I was definitely disappointed, and I truly hope that is so not that is not the end for him all right i'm not gonna say what happened that if you know what i mean what i'm talking about you guys know what i mean what does it mean what i'm saying so as you know that and uh jason momoa one of the greatest villain <laughs> jason momoa one of the uh, jason momoa stole the whole show i gotta be honest with you jason momoa did actually stole the show he made a great great performance to everybody and how villain he is, how much he really want to play it, play it off with Dominic Toretto. Dominic, he wanted to play it off with Dominic Toretto. How much, how much was meant to be losing his family? So he's trying to get his vengeance, vengeance, and revenge. Honestly, Dominic Toretto is not gonna let that happen. But Dominic Toretto seems to be a little bit struggle at, at the moment of that film. He just like focusing. Risking and the and the most difficult moment he ever he ever had to choose. He had to choose one of the family and friends. And uh, the directing was really good. I, I I do remember what what was going on. The old the previous director something about they have issue with when when Vin Diesel or something like that. I, I hadn't. I really don't know. I remember that he quit and then they found the director like a week later or second week later. Um he did the new the, the director who directed this film right now is did a good job. He did a good job. I it was definitely perfect perfect directing what he has done. They just have found they just found one instead of the the previous one. Um and uh and uh, there is there is some scene I Really did enjoy and and also ridiculous, <laughs> ridiculous. Uh, okay, let's talk about the, the the big ball. <laughs> if you know what I mean, the 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 atom. Okay, let's just say the atomic bomb ball. There we go. The atomic bomb ball is just one insane scene. I really love it. How how they do doing it, and especially when I saw the behind the scene. They actually really done it. They actually really done it like as a real ball, that the, at the real real thing, you know. I'm. It was actually good. I like the CGI they done. It very well done. Very well done that the CGI they ever done they ever done. And the how, how extremely ridiculous how, <laughs> how ridiculous is uh they make it a great to stop. To stop him, it was like it was just insane. Come on, <laughs> um, what else I have to say? Um, and also I like the fact that 
they zooming in inside the engine, the engine of the car while while Dominic Toretto just press the button to make it go fast mode. Of course, I ha they haven't done it for a very long time, for real. They haven't they haven't done it in a very long time since five past five or five six. If you know what I mean, like when when the Dominic Toretto, Dominic Toretto trying to turn on that thing to full of speed mode, right? And they they zooming in, they zooming in. So I mean, like inside the engine, inside the something machine, and I, I haven't seen this for a very long time. This is what I was talking about. I really expecting that because I've been waiting for that moment. Oh, finally! That, it, as a matter of fact, that that movie is not definitely Fast and Furious film. It's like an another adventure film, <laughs> adventure film. A heist, a heist, something like that. A heist film fantasy, of course. But I, I really have a great time watching it w with my friends. I actually have a great time. I loving it, and and of course that movie was definitely part one. And uh, I can tell you, my one of my favorite scene of all time. My favorite scene, of course, is is the one that the scene called. The scene on the line is say, when Dominic Toretto say this, you never took my car, and then, and then run, and then drive you on the wall. <laughs> I was insane. I I I was like, wow, no way, I like that. <laughs> I don't get me wrong. I will give this a chance of that film, but I really have a great time watching it. I really hope to see. What's gonna happen in the next one? And of course, there is. Uh, I wish I could tell you, but I wouldn't say it. But there is, there is gonna be continuing. That's what I could say. There's, there is gonna be continue of the film. There is gonna continue. I heard he said. I heard Vin Diesel say it's gonna be a three parts film. So this is the first part film. Now we head into the second film, second part, part one. Later this year, or probably next year, I believe. I believe so. Um. And the, and of course, I think that's all. That's all I can say for sure. I will give. Uh, okay, here's my recap. I want. I want to say the story that was really good. I like it. They could have done it early. They could have done it like after Fast and Furious Seven. Like I'm be honest. Second, I like the visual effect and the most challenging they ever done. And also, also the 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 driving skill was really insane. And then, uh, of course, why why don't we really just lift up the entire damn car? <laughs> I was like. Really? Are you trying to be the rock right now? <laughs> I was like, I was like, oh my god, there's no way. I was like that, but I did have a blast. I did have a blast, enjoyment, you know. Um, uh, and what else? Like, what else? And of course, my my reaction after the movie end, I was like, do not tell me that's gonna. Are you serious? That's how I'm gonna end it right there. I was like that. That's all. And of course. There is a two. There is one. Okay, and there is one. There is a post credit scene. Of course, there is a post credit scene. I, I wouldn't. I'm not gonna tell you, but I already knew this was coming. I already knew this was coming, and I was kind of hoping he will be back. But if you know what I mean, you know what I mean. All right. So, so yeah, that is so my review from for today. So, uh, I will give this solid. <laughs> You guys, you guys are gonna be surprised me that I have a, I really have a great time. I really, really did enjoy the entire movie. I, I hope, hope it will be good for the next, for the next uh, sequel film of sequel film. Uh, so I will give this a rating as a nine out of ten. Boom! There we go. This is my one ton of review. My rating nine out of ten. Passive. This is the highest passive. This is the highest rating I ever rated for a Fast and Furious film. Don't get me wrong, I actually did. So yeah, that is all I can say today. So I uh, hope you guys did enjoy my review. I hope you guys did. Uh, uh, if I did spoil you, I'm sorry, you know. So, <laughs> so yeah, I want you guys. <laughs> so I thank you all for watching this film and <sighs> that my bad. <laughs> Thank you all for watching this review. Hope you guys did enjoy my my review. Hope you guys know what to do, everybody. 
leave a like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next video. And stay tuned for the for the next movie review. What's on the What's on the view? Signing off. Later, guys.